Hello everyone, this is Jay Kalpana here. In this video, we are going to solve few problems from Laplace transforms. Let's get going. So here we are going to use these two formula. We know that L of cos a t is s by s square plus a square, right? Then L of cos h a t will be s by the denominator we are having plus in this formula, right? But here we'll get just a minus a square, s square minus a square, okay? Likewise, if L of sine a t equal to a by s square plus a square is a formula, we'll have sine h a t, that is Laplace transform of sine h a t will be a by s square minus a square. If you have plus in for a t, you'll have minus for h a t, okay? Fine. Now coming to the problems, first one, find L of sine h omega t. We know that L of sine h a t is a by s square minus a square for s greater than mod a. Then just compare sine h omega t with sine h a t. Then for a equal to omega, we'll get omega by s square minus omega square. Just replace a by omega in the formula. Okay. Therefore, L of sine h omega t equal to omega by s square minus omega square. Now coming to the second one. L of sine h phi t. Here also we are having, we are going to apply sine h a t formula which is a by s square minus a square for s square than mod a. Just compare sine h 5 t with sine h a t then for a equal to 5. Just replace a by 5 then we will get 5 by s square minus 5 square which gives us 5 by s square minus 5 square is 25. Therefore L of sin h 5 t equal to 5 by s square minus 25. Now coming to the third problem. Find L of cos h 2 t. Since we know that cos h a t equal to s by s square minus a square for s square then mod a. This equals to just compare cos h 2 t with cos h a t then for a equal to 2. Just replace a by 2 then we'll have s by s square minus 2 square which gives us s by s square minus 4. Therefore L of cos h 2 t equal to s by s square minus 4. Now coming to the fourth one. L of cos h 2 t minus cos 2 t. We can write this as L of cos h 2 t minus L of cos 2 t. Right. So we can apply the same formula for a equal to 2 here. Then we'll get s by s square minus 2 square because it is h right. So you'll get minus here. Minus we know that L of cos a t equal to s by s square plus a square compare cos 2 t with cos a t then for a equal to 2 or just replace a by 2 here we'll get L of cos 2 t is s by s square plus 2 square this gives us s by s square minus 2 square is 4 minus s by s square plus 2 square is 4 therefore L of cos h 2 t minus cos 2 t equal to s by s square minus 4 minus s by s square plus 4. Okay, fine. So we have seen few problems from Laplace transforms in this video. I hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.